Yeah, and this morning, though, the Colts will actually make sure Hoosier families are fed this Thanksgiving. In just a few hours, the Boys in Blue will kick off their ninth annual horseshoe helpings. It's a fun event every year. CBS 4's Alexa Green live at Lucas Oil Stadium with a preview ahead of that event. Good morning. Good morning to you, Angela and Nick. This is an event that we love to be a part of every single year. Uh, it's all about Hoosier hospitality happening today. The Colts, they are going to be help providing nearly 2000 meals to families here in Indiana for Thanksgiving. Joining me now, Ashley Powell. Ashley, I know you've been instrumental in this year's event. Tell me a little bit about the setup. Obviously, the tents are here ready to go. We're just waiting on the volunteers. Yeah, and the food, which should be here momentarily. So we're excited. Like you said, this is our ninth year. We're really excited to be able to provide this service to our community. So thanks to in our partnership with U.S. Foods and Meyer and Lucas Oil and Citizens, we're able to provide 2,000 Thanksgiving meal kits to families in need this holiday season. Um, so we're really looking forward to serving today. Tell us a little bit about some of these families who were already pre-selected. Correct, yes. We worked with the mayors, uh, neighborhood advocates, IMPD and a couple other groups to find some families that could really use a little bit of extra help this year. I think there's a lot of families this year that could probably use a lot of help. So um, we're just happy to be a part of that um, and excited to see them come through and be able to make their holidays a little bit easier and bear some of that burden for them. Absolutely. We know it's going to be a great event, a little different this year. I know it's a drive through. It's yeah. always been a drive through. <laughs> obviously, obviously, though, handling things in a pandemic makes it more of a challenge. It does. This was the one event going into this year. We were like, we can do this. It's a drive through event. But obviously, we've, we've expanded our footprint a little bit to allow people to spread out. Obviously, masks are required for all volunteers and patrons coming through and doing all of the pro proper checks and balances and different things like that. But otherwise, you know, we're going to be outside. We're hopefully getting some sunshine today. Um, so really, we're just excited to be able to continue to do this. And uh, it, it was not a huge change for us just with the masks and spreading out. So <laughs> well, Ashley, we know it's going to be a busy morning for you. So thank you for taking some time out this morning. Again, volunteers are going to be here starting at eight this morning and the drive through. It all begins at 9 a.m. Angie, Nick, we'll set it back to you.